Hi, I'm ER of Abigail's Basket and now we are going to learn how to make a healthy version of Guinamous. So yes, it looks better than Guinamous and it tastes better than Guinamous and way healthier than Guinamous. So let's start. So before anything else, let's heat the pan. Okay, only heat the pan if you are like just what happened now. Everything is all prepared so it, the pan won't be hot, too hot. Okay, so let's see. Kim sanay ng ginamos. Ginamos is um, what you see, what I see, or what you could see in um, in the kanang mga karinderya. It's basically fish nga muragi ferment sa og maayo and it's grayish and it's a lot of salt. It's usually salty. So right now it won't look uh, even like even an inch the same. So it's going to be um, it's going to look good. And yes, um, we're going to start. Here we go. Now we should heat the pan just right, no? Sakto gid siya kainit, dili po siya bugnaw kay mo pilit ko siya kung bugnaw pud. Okay, here we go. Now it's hot. While it's heating up, let's prepare this green onions. I want it this long and kaning sa green nga part, let's chop it into um, little circle things. It looks cute. Now that's enough. Okay. So, can you green nga part? Ito na siya i-reserve para unya. Para na siya greenish nga something else. And can you white nga things? Let's put this first. Kung init na tong pan. I heard that. And I hope you heard that too. Okay. There we go. Can you white nga part sa green onions? It smells so good pag apilon siya o gisa. Just a few seconds after that, let ginger. So, kanin ginger, you can, you can shred it, but I, I chopped it into like big, uh, small chunks. Okay, so, ato ni gisahon without oil. So, yes, we have a um, non-stick pan here. Kung wala mo non-stick pan, you can buy. <laughs> if dili pa mo kapalit actually, no? Kung dili pa, Kung wala pa available din ha, pwede mo magamit og stainless. Ayaw lang tong kaning aluminum. So stainless, basta if when it's just the right heat, di gina siya mapilit and ang may scraper. So fast stir fry. So kani siya, it's high fire. Here we go. Until nga masimutan ni mo ang green onions and until the uh, gar ginger, I mean, ginger becomes a little bit brownish and we can put in the garlic. There we go, garlic. So, basic na mga ingredients, no? I mean, nga mga lamas, nga itong ginabutang. Garlic and onions. There, garlic and onions. And then, ang ato ang hot salt. Yeah, sometimes, dili kayo okay ang isagol ang garlic and onions. But in this case, ang combination nila is a good combination. Then, add salt. There we go. Mixing this up. And then, ang ato ang dried mushroom. Okay. Ang ato ding dried mushrooms, ato na siyang gisoap daan. Before na to slice. Para humas humok siya slice. And, it's even tastier kung nasoak na siya daan and softer. Alright. Now it smells so good. We can put in one of the main ingredients, santol. Okay. Santol. And then, kauban sa santol, let's put in the tomatoes. There we go. Okay, so kaning santol, as you can see, it's shredded, diba? So, you have the santol here. Gipanita na sa daan. Tapos, ato din siyang gishred sa palibot. Ayun na, apil lang. Don't, don't include the seeds, no? It's just the peeling. So, as you can see, daghan yun di ay magamit. When you do, when you like cook vegan food, you'll discover things like you've never known before. Na? Magamit ay ang panit sa santol. So, it start, when it's starting to, to be too much hot, too hot, just lower the heat a little bit. 
and gisa gisa. So in food, yeah, that's right. Nagamit na to ang is wala gina kaunot uliso pero nagamit ng panit. Okay, ato ni we are cooking the santol a little bit long. Kay medyo upload ni siya and aslum, so it should be cooked a little bit even more. Here we go. Okay, so like one minute of mixing, stir frying without oil. Ato na ibutang ato ang coconut, the pinaka main ng ingredient. Okay. This coconut is grated, and kung kamo ang nagpalit sa coconut, mas maayos. It's better if you will be the one to choose the coconut. It should be not so old, dili siya matawag o lubi, and not too young. Like kaning dapat igu igu git siya nga separate sa. If you can see, it separates. Here we go. Mix and mix, stir. Okay. Yeah, if kung makitaan ninyo ang lubi, usually kung puti siya o shell, mauna siya ang sakto ka hinog or sakto ka gulang na coconut. Now that the coconut is here, we can add in some salt. Now, nakadundum tanga, ginamos ni siya, so be generous in putting the salt. There are lots of salt. But not too much kay kasi di na po siya makaon. Here we go. Mix and mix. And then, uh, itong duha ka herbs. Turmeric, it has a flavor and also it gives a yellow color. There we go. Mm -hmm. And curry. Curry powder. Okay. Mix and mix. So you really don't need oil here because coconut has a lot of fat, the good kind of fat. Okay, let's stir this up. I can smell it. Wow. All right. Okay. Oops. Here we go. Now, Sa tunga, while tunga tunga ni sa ato ang pagluto, atong tilawan ang iyang kaparat. Let's go see. Hmm. That's so, that's no good. Just the right amount of salt. So what we need here is just to stir fry it a little bit. And yes, let's leave this for a few seconds. Uh, put it low heat. Let's prepare our. Seaweeds. This is uh, what do you call this? Kim, kim or like kim, yeah, kim. Paper seaweeds, if you would like to call it. <laughs> Here we go. I just tear this. Kung kapuyan mo tear, you can actually use a scissor, scissors, and cut them. Okay. And meanwhile, doing this. Okay. okay so while we're letting the flavors come together. Diha sa lubi, sa santol, we are continuing to cut this up. So, I think this is enough. You can put more seaweeds if you want to. Alright. Now, I can smell all of this together. Ibalik na to siya sa medium heat like the heat a while ago. Mix a little bit and put in the seaweeds. There we go. Hmm. I smell the seaweeds. The seaweeds kay mo hatag siya gamay nga fishy taste if you want it to be. Because ginamos is basically made of fish. So you want the smell of fish in there. Okay. There you go. Okay. Everything is mixed up well. Give it lastly a taste. There we go. Hmm. Wow. Now, lastly. And yes. Let's see the tofu. Let's mash the tofu gently. And if you're using a non-stick pan, be careful that you don't want to eat fork in a non-stick pan. There we go. Well mashed. You can actually mash it so well, but that, that wasn't so good. So, you don't want to mash it. It's a little chunky. 
look something like eggs. There we go. Alright, mix and mix, steer and steer. Ito na siyang i-mix hangtod ma-distribute o maayaw ang ito ang tofu. Alright, mix. Alright, so you see, this meal is like almost complete also, di ba? Na ay tofu, that's um, protein. Na ay lubi, that's fat, good fat. And it's not only healthy, but it's really delicious. And you can put this inside the ref. Anytime nga, example, huwag mo kalutog sudan, pag ulit nyo siyang balay, buta yung pagawas nyo sa ref, with rice or with something else, that's going to be really good. Okay. Yeah, I think everything has been mixed together. The flavors are already good. Now, let's turn the fire off and let's put it in a platter. There we go. Oops. Here. Okay. And the green onions. That will give a taste and a greenish color and that's really so good so yes right now we're going to give it a last taste here we go mm. wow and yes what you can do with the rice and you can also eat it with pet chai leaves and right now na atay radish leaves right from the farm of my mother you can eat it like this oh wow Ginamos, vegan ginamos in radish leaves. Mm. Wow. I mean, oh, the bite in the radish leaves. Let me finish this. Mm. And the taste of the ginamos, so good. And you saw, it was so easy. And it's like it has become a tagline easy, but healthy, and especially yummy. Mmm, yummy. So my friends, learn so much more by looking into our other videos. And yes, you know what? I'm still chewing here. It's, it's still so good. That's it. It's all done. So remember my friends, God wants you to be healthy, safe, and happy. And especially He wants you to enjoy. So embark with our journey and enjoying healthy food and learning. God bless you. He's coming, Broadcasting Network.